How about you? You lose any weight? A lot. Like you said, the arm. Like right now, when I look at it, it looks. Skinny. Cause shouldn't it be like boom? Yeah. Yeah. When I look at it, it's, it's skinny. skinny. Yeah. Or our heads. Swim. Small. Oh, I want. Oh. Can we change clothes? Of course. It's over. Go, basically, Come on. Why? Go. I think he, like all the other masters, were like, you know, like, um, yeah, just massage my hand. Carlo had just wash his underwear. Yeah. That's just, what Kuya wants. Oh, I guess he, he was doing it right. That's what Kuya wants. I thought yeah, that was just, to just said it was okay, though. Yeah, it was okay, it's just for fun, but, you know, Kim might have taken it personally. Cause, but uh, Kim was she wasn't assigned anyone specifically. She said yeah, that's the thing. Um, Koloke last announcement was to go there to the other house and clean their house. Ah, uh, that's when it really got enough. Huh? Mm, because earlier today, before we started, when when it was announced that we were gonna be their slaves, she didn't like it. It reminded her of that time when she had to be there. Yeah, she had to be a house elf. And had to clean, cook, and do stuff, and she didn't want it. How come? No, she was I, like, I haven't worked it. The house elf? Ah! Oh. And remember, Tiba, she talked to her dad that time. You heard it, Tiba. Yeah. You heard but it. barely, I could yeah, barely hear the conversation. Yeah, probably it was her dad. But anyway, you heard something, right? And mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure Kim was crying that time. So probably you just reminded her of that time. You know? And it was pretty emotional for her, just to get, just you know, just to be able to talk to her dad. She had to go through something bad, so probably just reminded her of that time. And she didn't like it, and she didn't like the idea that we were serving our competitors, our contenders. You know, it's okay if it's just within us. You know, we know each other. Yeah. And we'd understand how and why. You know those questions, how and why. But to her, probably she, you know, she doesn't like the idea of serving them. And probably it built up since yesterday's game. Mm -hmm. You know, she got frustrated. She got pretty mad. Remember, she went into her room and yeah, she was pretty affected too. Yeah, she was just... affected. Or this earlier this morning, she was affected. She didn't want any negative thoughts, but she couldn't help it. She was just upset. And and to top it all off, you know, like Luz yesterday, she was saying things, she was saying things about, you know, that like we're we're losers and we we, we always lose, and you know, it kind of made me feel like she wanted to be there. Yeah, yeah. me too. Very nice. Completely honest. Completely honest. So that's what kind of hit her, you know. Parang siguro nasaktan lang talaga siya. Parang we keep, we, we give everything, pero there's something missing. That's what she said this morning. There's something missing about our team. Parang there's something lacking. And I think, I don't think it's something lacking, but I mean, rather, it's, it's something we're not doing. Or something some of us are not doing. It's like, we're saying we're, we're saying we're giving 100%, but it's just some of us, uh, and not all of us. We're saying that, you know, we're giving 100%, but they, sometimes I feel like, the loyalty to our team, sometimes it's not there. Some mm -hmm. of our members. I couldn't really name names now. But I feel like it's meant to be, it's meant to be. That's what I see. Yes, yes, you are correct. But also, it is also true that we can do something about it. That's true too. That's why but if we can do something about it, they can do something about it. As well, that's that's why I believe the whole if it's meant to be, it's meant to be because like mm -hmm. we both have an input in the outcome. Yes. Sometimes our input, you know, is one hundred percent, but it's just there's something. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. like, like there's something. Or mm -hmm. well, they have a little step above us. Yeah, they're oh, always one step ahead. Because okay, say we knew about that. Ah, say we did that, there would be a fighting chance. Yeah. I would definitely have thrown like four yeah. or five over. Or five balloons. One yeah, pop. Yeah, if we realize that we could, you know, what I what I thought, what I told you. Oh yes, yeah. if we realize that early, because like, Cause the our, first, our balloons were really good. The they, first four attacks, yeah.
they break even in the the bar. You notice the blue balloons didn't really break when yeah. it hit the defense the, the shield. Uh -huh. That's also a good thing. Yeah. That they made it small because it wouldn't break. Because if it splattered, it would have gotten our our paper wet, our our flags wet. True. And then it just rips. But with us, I noticed even though it wasn't, it was far from the it would hit. from the yeah, it would the splatter. And most of the time, the shields were up here. And even if it hit the shield, it would break. Wow. So that's why some of the 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 the, the flags or the yeah was wet in the okay. upper part. Had we known that? Yeah, because I mean, come on, the first four attacks we didn't get any over. Mm. The first four, yeah, the like first huh, one from yeah, the first four, two for uh, attack B and two for attack A. Yeah, none got over like one mm. or two. Mm. If okay. we had known, ah, we probably would have. Eventually, we would have put. I was gonna try to yeah, put two and our balloons were better if they were bigger. You know why? It, because it would really it breaks. Yeah, had we known that we could it's do so that. Because it's so stretched. The the thing. Uh -huh. How how you would l use the lacrosse? That one. And Kim's lacrosse was really big. Yeah. It could, yeah, it could put like five, five, six balloons in one go. Even if it didn't really reach the flag, the water would. The wa yeah, the water would splatter. That's why I'm like, damn. 